What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Cups to decide you, everybody in between. Double the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it doesn't flow. Excuse me. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Free general collective reading. Okay, so. I received a channel in. Um, I'm going to share it with you guys real quick. Um, wow. Just saying. Just saying. Um, it's at least for one person out in my collective. By the way, we're at 12,300 subscribers. So thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel, you guys. If you think anyone else could benefit from these uh, messages or the channel or what have you, um, please feel free to share my videos on your social media and word of mouth. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. It helps support a single mama, one of her income streams. So thanks so much. I appreciate it. All right. So the channel message I received was, um, uh, oh, I want to say this real quick too. If you hear any tarot readers speak about the Secret 7 situation, please contact me. I'm not saying they are, but I have a sneaking suspicion some might be. Readers can't be talking about, uh, they can't use the term the Secret 7. I have it copyrighted um, for reasons. They can talk about the situation without using the term Secret 7, the Secret 7, or my hashtag S7. Um, so if you, you know, hear the term the Secret 7 in a reading or hashtag S7 or something like that, please contact me. I just, I appreciate it. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, a pregnant Taurus feminine is about to find out she is pregnant with triplets, triplets. And I heard huge chaos there because it is an affair. I don't know. That's at least for one of you guys out there. Uh, there's a Taurus feminine apparently either currently in an affair or was in an affair. And the pregnancy sounds like it is by the person or people she was in an affair with. Um, but it's not, she's about to find out she's not pregnant with one child, three triplets. That's three. Triple deuces. Boom. Three. So not only is she dealing with an affair, either currently or past, past, past energetic space. But she's going to have three babies with a person or people, you know, she might be had an affair or is having an affair with one or two plus people. But three babies, three babies, three babies, three babies. What? <laughs> um, you plug it in, how it resonates. I have two kids, um, 16 and 14, and they were not together. They were not twins i couldn't imagine having twins couldn't imagine having triplets nor would i want that um some people enjoy that nay nay for me um so you plug it in how it resonates um she's got a lot going on she's got a lot whoever this person is um but it sounds like the baby's father is the person or people she was having an affair with plug it in how it resonates man We'll do this one real quick. The unexpected. You can't make this crap up even if you wanted to. Number 43 could be a very significant number of one's life. Oh my gosh. Number 43. Be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to. Possible lottery number. Possible day birth number. Possible green card number. Possible jersey number. Number 43. Unexpected. About to find out. This person, this pregnant, I heard a pregnant Taurus feminine. She could have Taurus in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Moon, and to Jupiter charts. She's in an affair either now or was. I, obviously, I feel the children are the baby daddies that she was in an affair with or what either is currently or was. She could have Taurus in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, North Moon, and to Jupiter charts. Unexpected. About to find out she's having triplets. Three. Three babies. Not just one. Three. And it's by Baby Daddy, is what it sounds like here. Oh, a fairy Baby Daddy. Oh, my Lord. Oh. Spirit messages you have for the question. Part of this karma is because she is 
butted into people's destinies. Know this. Oh, my Lord. I heard part of this karma is because she's butted into people's destinies. Know this. Um, so part of her, this karma, it, I mean, doesn't sound like she meant to get pregnant to begin with because it's, it sounds like it's by, you know, a fairy baby daddy over here. But part of the karma, I guess maybe because she, there's so many kids is because um, she, it sounds, I heard she butted her um, nose, vagina, head, what, body into somebody else's destiny um that's that's strong when you butt your nose head vagina whole insert whole self um in this case her whole bodily self into somebody's destiny um that's not gratitude but just saying just saying oh, spirit messages you have like this what? grounding reverse gratitude upright let me see if i hear anything Number 23 could be very significant number in one's life. Number 23, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible day birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number. Um, 23. Michael Jordan is what I just heard. Michael Jordan. I just heard Michael Jordan. So you plug it in how it resonates. I don't know if that's the celebrity Michael Jordan, you know, like, oh, actually, Michael Jordan, the celebrity, the basketball celebrity, his basketball number, I think, was 23 when he was full on, full fledged career. It could be the cele basketball celebrity Michael Jordan, or it could be another Michael Jordan. I'm not sure. All I heard was Michael Jordan, very specifically. Um, uh, I, I hear names sometimes, but then I hear don't say them. Um, I didn't hear not say this, so, um, but, you know, it could be the famous celebrity Michael Jordan, or it could be another Michael Jordan, um, you know, the name Michael's very common, the name Jordan's very common, so, put it, into, it's like my name, Mary Smith, do you know how many Mary Smiths there are out in the universe? A shit ton, so, I mean, it could be, there could be 5.3 million Michael Jordans in the universe, I mean, obviously, there is a basketball celebrity, Michael Jordan, and I'm pretty positive his career number was 23. Um, or it could be another Michael Jordan. Maybe Michael Jordan is the daddy of these triplet babies she's about to find out she's pregnant with. Or it could be maybe it's her father. Maybe it's her grandfather. Maybe it's her husband if she's married. Maybe it's um, somebody else. Uh, maybe it's somebody she's dealing with named Michael Jordan. Maybe it's Michael Jordan is somebody, uh, the name she's going to name one of these kids. I'm not sure. I just heard Michael Jordan. <laughs> you plug it in how it resonates. Oh, my God. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just the messenger. Don't shoot the messenger. Gratitude and um, grounding reversed. This is about to affect many people's lives, high profile people's lives, very high profile. The truth will be forced out. Oh my Lord, I heard this is about to affect many high profile people's lives, many. The truth is about to be forced out. I don't, I heard high profile, so I don't know if this is an actual basketball celebrity, Michael Jordan, or somebody high up in the public, um, in their community, or stature or social status or what have you name michael jordan or the basketball celebrity michael jordan but somehow michael jordan man or woman i'm showing phil's prime man is involved with somehow a pregnant horse feminine and three and proud to find out she's pregnant with three triplets but i heard it's an affair and many people high profile people are about to be connected so Affected. So whether it's celebrity people affected or high profile people up in the community or um, community world, what have you. Um, I don't know if it's celebrity status or um, community stature, social status. Um, gratitude, thankful that, uh, oh, I don't know. Let me see. I, I don't know. Let me see if I hear anything. A lot of child support will come here. A lot. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. 
oh my lord, I had a lot of child support will come here a lot. So I guess thankful this person, it doesn't sound like they're going to get bullied, harassed, targeted, bullied. Um, it sounds like it's going to flow the right way and this person's going to get a lot of child support. I heard basically a shit ton. I don't know if it's, I wonder if it's the basketball celebrity, Michael Jordan, or somebody else. I think this might be the baby daddy or somebody connected to finding out she's having triplets. Or maybe it's the baby daddy. I don't know. Somehow Michael Jordan's significant, a uh, shit ton of, um, whether it's a celebrity or somebody else, and a shit ton of um, child support will come. So whoever the baby daddy is, the fairy baby daddy is, um, he's very wealthy, um, very wealthy, whether he's named Michael Jordan or not. So gratitude, this person's going to get a shit ton of child support, I guess. And then ungrounding for the baby daddy. And others, um, maybe the baby daddy is married, is what I'm thinking. Maybe the baby daddy's married, so ungrounding for if he's married, um, him, his wife, his family. Um, this is going to be public shame energy, I feel, like public shame energy. But you, you put, oh, God, this is terrible. This is going, this information being revealed is going to prompt someone connected to this situation to call the FBI on the Secret 7 situation of the past. Oh my lord. I heard this per, This information being publicly revealed is going to prompt someone connected to this situation to call the FBI regarding the Secret 7 situation of the past. So I think it's somebody that's going to be ungrounded about this uh, tor pregnant Taurus femme finding out she's pregnant with um, triplets by a apparently a very wealthy baby daddy. Maybe named Michael Jordan or not. Um, I'm serious. I wonder if it's, um, it's somebody connected to either the baby wealthy baby daddy or somebody else. Um, they're going to call the FBI. I heard on the Secret 7 situation in the past. When this information comes very public. Doesn't sound like this person will be targeted, bullied, anything like that. Um, I mean, they're pregnant. Please, God, don't target or bully any pregnant people or anybody, period. Um, but Secret 7 was all about targeting, gang stalking, and bullying. Uh, a poor single mother and her family. So, I mean, this person doesn't sound like they're going to get um, targeted and bullied and all that. But it's about to cause some huge waves in the community or celebrity world, basketball celebrity world, if it is celebrity Michael Jordan, I'm not saying it is. There's a ton of shit ton of Michael Jordans in the universe, I'm presuming. You plug it in, how it resonates. We, all, we also have MB number 20 to be very significant number in one's life. But some, however, whoever this is and however it applies, they know about the Secret 7 situation in the past. And they're about to call the FBI and relay information on it when this comes very public. I think when this Taurus fan find out she's pregnant with triplets. Um, and whoever is the baby daddy here is about to be publicly exposed. Because he's got about to be in a world for her, a world of hurt in the legal system with some um a shit ton of child to pull it, baby. Number 20 to be very significant number, number 20. Be a possible age of viewers, somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible day of birth number, possible green card number, possible jersey number, number 20, envy. I heard uh, this pregnant towards fam, she, she's receiving negative karma basically because she butted her nose into somebody's destiny. So I think this envy card is for this pregnant, uh, it doesn't sound like she wants these triplets. Uh, I don't even know if she wanted one kid. Only she knows she's uh, her story, not anybody else. Pregnant Taurus family, if you watch this, if this is your story. Or somebody connected to Pregnant Taurus fam. It does sound like you even wanted the kid. Uh, maybe you did, maybe you didn't. Maybe you're trying to entrap this uh, wealthy person with one child, and then you ended up getting three, um, possibly. Either you didn't want the one child, period, or you wanted a child and tried to entrap him, and then you ended up with three. However that resonates. But I think this is for you. Because you were jealous. A person, people, place, or situation. I heard you basically butted yourself into somebody else's destiny. Your vagina, your whole body, your whole self. So now this is the karma with the three kids. Um, 
But it sounds like you're being compensated very well for it. So you plug it in how it resonates. So envy, but you're going to have a lot of mouths to feed and a lot of doctor's appointments and, ooh, ooh, envy. There was no respect here in the past. None. It is about to seriously backfire on everybody involved here. Oh, my Lord. I heard there was no respect in the past. None. And it's about to seriously backfire on a lot of people involved here. So you plug it in how it resonates. People were envious of somebody. Of somebody in the Secret 7 situation or something of that nature. They're envious of somebody. It's about to seriously backfire. I heard on a lot of people involved in this. Um, whoever and however this was. All right. Love you guys. Namaste. Hope this helped.